Thanks for joining us again on Celebrating Act Two. Now, you know that Art and I love reviewing movies and reviewing books and talking to people. Um, interestingly enough, when we review a movie or a TV series, we kind of get into it, describe the whole thing and talk about it and analyze it. But when we get a book, we go to the author. And uh, we've we've interviewed some wonderful authors. I love interviewing the author's art because they not only tell us about the book, they give us a perspective from the creator's point of view. Mm. So I love our author interviews. And of course, last week, we just posted our interview with J.A. Jans mm. uh, for her upcoming, uh, her brand new J.P. Beaumont novel. And next week, we've got a special J.A. Jans interview. Yeah, After the Fire, her book of poetry that she actually wrote in secret before uh, her first marriage ended, but when it was really rocky and and yeah. uh, she, she she was not allowed to write. So it's her backstory. If you can but, believe that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah uh, one of the fascinating things we find about J.A. Jantz uh, is that uh, she's about our age, late 70s, and she didn't start writing until she was publishing her first book. She, she was like 38. So she done yeah. it only in the second half of her life. She's published over 70 uh, uh, books, many of which are on the New York Times bestseller list. So yeah. she's fascinating. And and so after the fire, which comes out in about a week or two, uh, she talks about this book uh, in, in particular. And uh, we've also in earlier interviews with her, gotten a lot of her backstory on her life. And uh, uh, in, in this uh, uh, video, we look below, you'll see a link to uh, Den of Iniquity, which we just released last week, After the Fire, and uh, which will come out in about a week or so. And also one of our other favorite uh, uh, authors, uh, um, uh, Herbie J. Pilato, who uh, we right. probably interviewed him on five or six of his books as well. Yeah. And um, Well, his, uh, most, his most recent book, uh, we just uh, played the interview what, three weeks ago? Something like that? Was on Diana Rigg. Yeah. His book what, is, is a One Tough Diana, Dame. Diana Rigg, One Tough Dame, yeah. And yeah. as like all his books, Herbie's uh, Metier, I guess is, uh, is the right word. Uh, he loves writing about uh, celebrities, television, uh, movies. He did a book on uh, 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 James Bond. Um, what's Sean, Sean Connery. Sean Connery. Right. Um, Elizabeth Montgomery, and yeah. his latest one is on um, uh, Diana Rigg. Yeah, but also uh, also Adventure. earlier, and by the way, for both J.A. Jansen and Herbie J. Pilato, there are playlists, so if you go to our YouTube channel, solarreniac2.com, look at the playlist and you'll see the five or six interviews we've done with yes. Herbie J., with J.A. Jans, and uh, the er some of the earlier ones that we've done with them uh, go more in-depth into their backstory of uh, how they became writers. Uh, Herbie J was a page at NBC, uh, right. uh, so he's got, got and and he's a he's a known authority on um, uh, uh, early television. Yep, uh, he has a, had a special relationship personally with Elizabeth Montgomery, and I think she he's done several books on her. But all of the the guys and the girls of the early. Uh, 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 television, uh, like uh, all the yeah. girls, like Gidget, and yeah. uh, all, all the uh, uh, starring guys. So they're fascinating people, and we're honored to have them among uh, what we consider to be friends because we, we chat with them from time to time, but they are truly remarkable people. Yeah. And uh, we uh, look forward to reading more of their stuff and reporting on more of it for you. Well, it's important that you not only watch these interviews because they're fascinating people in their own right, but also, you're going to love their books. Mm. So don't be afraid to go on after you watch the interview, go on Amazon and pick up the books. And I, by the way, I just want to, in case we left you with the wrong impression, After the Fire is J.A. Jance's, it might be her first book that she wrote while her husband was abusing her and saying, you are never going to be a writer. That to the woman who wrote 70 novels later. Um, but it's an older book. And it 
it just got published, I think, only a few years ago, maybe 10, 15 years ago, uh, because it was hidden. She found it in the papers. She found it in a, a lockbox or something like that and realized, oh, my God, this is this is the beginning of me as a writer. Um, and it's a wonderful it's a book of poems, completely mm. different than anything else. She's it, expre so, it expresses how she felt in her marriage, in her yes. uh, in her inability to write because her husband wouldn't permit her to write. And yeah. this, by the way. Jay Jantz uh, is a, a brilliant woman. She uh, has a, a college degree from the same university that uh, her husband graduated from, I think. And uh, but he said, and they were both in a writing program. But he said there'll only be one writer in this family. That'll be me. He never published anything. She published. But these are these are the books. These are the poems that she read during that miserable part of her life yeah. uh, uh, before. Uh, they they uh, separated and uh, yeah. she had a life of her own. So anyway, yeah. all well, three of those references to the Diana Rigg, to yep. the uh, Den of Inequity with uh, Jay Jance, and uh, Into the Fire. And uh, it, you can go find it now, even though it won't be released officially for a week. Yeah. Uh, you can actually link to it right now. Plus the playlist will exist uh, uh, so that you can watch the five or six interviews we've yeah. done with both of them. But they're really... Uh, terrific. If you have a favorite author and uh, you've been in touch with them, uh, maybe through their blog or something, and would like us to uh, maybe uh, do a series with them, uh, give us an introduction. Yep. We, we love our books and we love our authors. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.